Hello everyone, welcome to another 6mm Revolution video. Today we're going to be looking at the Daniel Defense 9 inch AR-15 light rail system for M M4, well I guess you could put it on an M16 if you want to, airsoft gun, but this specific one is in tan. So let's just open this up and just see. Well, first thing you have, obviously well protected in bubble wrap, but you have a Mad Bull Airsoft sticker because Mad Bull is the company that actually licensed to distribute these. You have your barrel nut, also in tan. And I want you to see this tan once we get this out. Uh, you have some assembly hardware. You've got a, excuse me, this is the bracing mount for the rail system. This is your barrel nut that comes with it, so you don't have to buy a separate barrel nut. You have a pin that helps hold this in place. And you have your, I think, six mounting screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven, nope, six. Six mounting screws. Uh, Allen head that uh, mount this up. Uh, I've ran one of these before. I'll talk about that in a second. But what I'm going to do, back this up a little bit, I'm going to take all this out and I'll cut right back and we'll take a closer, closer look at this. We have our Daniel Defense Light 9-inch quad rail unboxed. Let's just give it a quick peek. This is the tan version. You can see when that light hits it. Actually kind of a burnt bronze color. Uh, it's marketed as tan, but it actually looks burnt bronze. Uh, you see, and that thing in the light just really looks good. I mean, that's pretty, pretty accurate representation, I guess. I don't know how well this is showing up. But see that cool mounting base? That's why I fell in love with these. I just love the way that looked, that mounting base. But let's just give it a quick peek. T-marked rails. Uh, see there are manufactured under license from Daniel Defense. And there it's noted that it's for airsoft use only. Wouldn't want to put this onto a real gun. Wouldn't Probably wouldn't hold up very long, but look at the excellent manufacturing uh, there. The AR-15 Rail 9.0. Got our, all our ventilation holes here. Ventilation for what would be the gas tube in the real gun. Uh, but uh, this thing goes on. You have uh, some parts here. You have the base plate that actually mounts it onto the gun. You have a barrel nut that works in conjunction with this base plate. Some screws that screw the base plate to the actual free float. This little pin uh, acts as a guide up in your, kind of behind your hop-up bucking and keeps this straight where it doesn't start tilting with pressure. But let me just, I have a, uh, I have a combat machine here. It's partially assembled. Converting this thing over to a one-piece outer barrel. Uh, but I just want to show what you do. Let's see if I can get all this in frame. Is this, your base plate, would slide on like so onto your barrel. So you'd have the base plate. Well, this is showing up here. And then you take your barrel nut and you thread your barrel nut onto your barrel threads and that secures the base plate in conjunction with this little pin that I was talking about. This little silver pin goes right up in that hole right there and that keeps this from wobbling. So it locks it. So you've got it locked where it can't wobble this way. And then you've got the barrel nut. All this comes with the rail and that holds your barrel in place but it also holds this in place and then from this take your rail system. It's on your base. You slide it up in there so it would mount in there like so. And you take your screws, got some Allen head screws, and you screw those on. So then you have installed on your gun a rail system like so. Let me actually move this back a little bit. I think we can. I wanted to show you how far this actually comes. So you see, you still can see your M4 barrel profile but it actually comes right up to the gas block so your gas blocks just gonna right up to that gas block so you won't see the gas block notches or anything like that in your barrel get this out of the way okay but that's just a quick little video to cover this daniel defense 
quad rail. Look at that thing. That is beautiful rail system. Very, very well made. Yeah, but just want to do a quick video, cover that, let you guys see it, and make your own decisions if this is the right rail system for you. Maybe this video will help you out. Thanks for watching. Everyone have a great day.